Does this need to be filmed? I don't need a film crew. Whitney Houston, Intimate, Unguarded, the documentary footage no one has seen. In a white tux, playing piano, dancing, the rare video shot by one of her closest friends. Still to come tonight, the Whitney Houston home movies no one has ever seen before. Dancing, playing the piano, and totally unguarded. Plus, I was honored to be when you're expecting. And now we have all new, just uncovered images of Whitney Houston. Now, while her final years were marked by so much pain and struggle, these candid home movies showed just how much life was still left in the superstar. Our Chris Jacobs has the story. Whitney unguarded. I don't need a film crew. Pumped up for a photo session two years ago and playing to the camera. This is me at the end of the session that I'm so totally just. I'm like, you know, having that moment of, Whoa. A rare look at a superstar worried about her image and her look. But look, okay. And it, look how amazing that gold comes off that cream. But it's look how I had to come out that black and get into the cream, y'all. The white tux with the gold necklace was so stunning, the picture was used on the back cover of her funeral program. Recording the private moments on a cell phone is her friend and stylist, Tiffany Dixon. Okay, Tiffany has taken out to filming everything. Mm -hmm. This needs to be filmed. Should it? That's gorgeous. gorgeous. When we do from now on, not only will we need a camera to a camera. camera. See, this is a documentary. Basically, mm -hmm. you think, mm -hmm. sister? Yeah. Sister, I think. I agree. What was your sense of Whitney on that day? What kind of mood was she in? She was very happy that day. She was excited about going on tour. Um. She was just. She. Let me say. The memory of Whitney is painful, but the day was joyous. Tiffany and Whitney's crew following the star around the house before the photo shoot begins. I'm still getting you. I'm following you. Then, a rare and touching moment, Whitney sits down to play the piano. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Huh. I like it. Let me see. Let me see. I had no idea that she played the piano None at all, and, and that she was that proficient at it. None of us did. It was a shock to all of us, you know? And I, it, it was amazing that I, all of a sudden, I'm, I'm just, by chance, I'm capturing this, this moment, and here she goes, and she sits down, and she starts playing the piano, and I'm like, wow. <laughs> Another wow moment is the dancing and lip syncing to the 70s hit Loving Is Really My Game by Brainstorm. Is that kind of when the idea became real? We, sh we should do this. We should document Whitney's life. When you talk about the documentary, um, that would have been great if she could have had, if they could have had someone following her, that would have been fabulous. But, you know, but I caught those few moments and it just so happens though that those moments were like pivotal moments in her life I think and we have more from Tiffany what did she see the last night that Whitney was alive and did Whitney have a premonition about her death you will hear those new details on Monday's ET